Hi guys, welcome to episode 114. This week we're in Bali. Bella gets attacked by some fish and we meet up with a very special friend. We've just uh, pulled anchor at Gili Air and we're heading across to Bali today. So we're leaving Lombok. We had a nice time here. Gili Air is beautiful, it's a bit quiet at the moment, but um, after the earthquake, we, what did we do? We rode around the island and we hired some bikes yesterday and the day before and that was nice. Just cruised around, had a bit of a look. We had a bit of a snorkel. Um, I didn't video a lot of it because our new GoPro, well our latest GoPro, the battery actually melted in it, so that's not going. And then yesterday, uh, the other GoPro that we had that we knew had water in it, and that's the reason why we got a new one, um, stopped working. <laughs> so, get no luck. We had no luck. The water's beautiful. I mean, it wasn't incredibly amazing diving, but that's okay. Oh yeah, we had a night dive too. That was cool. We're heading to Noosa Lumboggan today. Um, we've talked to a few people and they reckon you can't anchor there, but there might be more ring boys and there says there's an anchorage in the guide, so we'll know when we get there, but it's about 40 nautical miles away. There doesn't appear to be much wind. Um, we will see how we go. So, change of plan guys, we were going to head to Noosa Lumboggan, but last minute we decided to go to Ahmad. So we figured uh, Ahmed's up the top. Oh, I just spat. Ahmed's up the top, and to get back up there, if we went down to uh, like Dempazar way, it might be a little bit tricky, and it's going to cost you know a lot in fuel. So we thought we'll go to Ahmed. Ahmed is a tranquil coastal area of fishing villages in East Bali, and a very popular scuba diving place. We heard there was a pretty awesome wreck here too, and that afternoon we arrived, we went to find it. About half an hour in the tender later, just on sunset, we went for a bit of a free dive, but our GoPro was stuffing up. It's a beautiful morning here at Ahmed. And this morning we're going to go and dive the shipwreck that's here. I was just trying to think of the name of it. You remember the name of the shipwreck? Listeria or something. I don't know the name of it, but we're going to dive a shipwreck. The ship's name was USS Liberty, and it was the most famous dive site in Bali, and also one of the best sunken shipwrecks in the world. We all walk with an outer glow, living on our insides. All right, we're ready. Again. We all know, but we all pretend. Earth's been around again. Attempt number one. Well, back up, Lee forgot his weights. Attempt number two. And Taj's ears were not cooperating. What happens sometimes when I dive is I can't equalise and my head hurts. When this happens, Mum and Dad tell me it's really important not to continue the dive. If after a few attempts, I can't. So me and Mum went back up to the surface and I knew how much Mum wanted to dive so I talked her in to going back down while I stay back on the surface and try again another day. Third time lucky and we went down. It was unreal. So much colour and life. And even though there were so many divers here, it felt like we were diving it all on our own. 
The Liberty ship was hit by a Japanese torpedo, then was beached near to Lamban in 1963. The eruption of Mount Ang caused the vessel to slip off the beach and now it lies on a sand slope in 9 to 30 metres of water. The wreck is about 130 metres long, with the shallowest part about 5. So today we are going to Ubud to meet with Wendy, our friend who has brought over a heap of stuff for us. Uh, it's very exciting. It's about a two hour drive. We've hired a car with the driver and we're about to head there now. Today is going to be awesome! Right that way to Ubud. Started. On our way to meet Wendy, we met Wendy and Alex back in June 2017 at Lady Musgrave. Sometimes people come along in your life and you instantly feel a connection. This was the case with Alex and Wendy. We stayed in contact and here we are today in Ubud, Bali. <laughs> So we're just here with Wems and she's totally spoiling us. Oh, yes. <laughs> 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 we're so excited we're here with you. We fell in love with you guys. It was like we were instant family. I know, that's what happens. So. <laughs> yeah. So, our beautiful friend Wendy has carted all of this stuff over for us from Australia. So we've got some little gift baggies and uh, we're very exciting. See? <laughs> little llama for Bella. <laughs> oh, that's oh. cute. Charlotte oh. chose that for you. She thought, oh. Like thank you, Charlotte. I love all the things you chose for me. Oh, that's close. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Oh, violet grey. Okay. So what did you get oh, in look. your care package? Look, the reason I haven't been catching any fish lately is I haven't had a filleting knife. So oh. now I've got the filleting knife. I oh, that makes back sense. To business. Makes sense. Oh, thank goodness. We can now have fish again. <laughs> <laughs> some impellers. So we'd used our last one the other day. Um, water pump, inverter, squid attracting light, 
Thank you, Michael. I brought that for us. Thank you so much. Um, rubbers for the spearing equipment. They're all getting a little bit perished now from the sun over here. Oh, new toothbrush. Right, new Woo! toothbrush. <laughs> oh, new toilet impeller in that bag too. We actually gave one to a. And my favourite to toothpaste. Uh, another sailor. Vanilla paste. Different flavours. Oh. You've got some more things. Oh, what's that? Prawn oh, that's... Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> Thank you. Had to just bring the plastic bags. I wouldn't have normally, but I had to. Yeah, you've been got it sometimes. Well, I had to do it in case it all exploded. But it's reusable. But so they're that. reusable. You can reuse and reuse, reuse, reuse. Reuse. Because otherwise it would have, ex could have exploded. Yeah. yeah, that's true. No problem. That was one. I've got... Hopefully that'll work. We've had some really nice time around the pool, got some presents, and we're about to walk to the monkey forest. See some monkeys. He's a poser, look at him. Yeah. It just smelt its bum. <laughs> sitting here with my friend while he's having lunch. So that was the monkey forest. We had a good time. Everyone did except Bella. She's still looking behind us. But uh, we saw some monkeys. What a people. Look at you coming down the entrance. <laughs> Here she comes. <laughs> Someone take my towel. <laughs> Such a queen.
So we just got back to Catalpa. Um, we had a really fun day and we met up with Wins. And I just wanted to say again a massive thank you. She bring a heap of stuff over for us. Also Wen's girlfriends that uh, were with her that let her put some stuff in their bags. Thank you. Um, we are excited. We've got new sheets. New clothes, the kids got some clothes, Lee got some boat bits, and uh, I got some nice stuff for my face. We got all in uh, important things, you know, toothbrushes, toothpaste, all the things that I like. So, yeah, it was a really fun day, and it was really nice seeing you, Wens, and uh, hopefully we see you again soon. So that was episode 114. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give a thumbs up or subscribe and give a comment down below. If you want to see where we are in real time, you can go follow us on Sailing Catalpa on Instagram and Facebook. Yeah guys, so we're currently in Phuket in Thailand and we just wanted to say from our family to yours, Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas! We're super excited about 2019 and we've got an update on our plans coming very, very soon. But we just wanted to say thank you for your support. 2018 was incredible. We love each and every one of you. And uh, yeah, we just wanted to say a massive thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. See you next year. Bye. Bye.